Welcome back to my YouTube channel, Metastic Days. In this video, I'll be going over how I studied for anatomy and how I got things to stick a bit better. So, uh, with anatomy, obviously there is multiple ways to study, but this is one of the techniques that does help and I found it to be helpful to my study routine and it doesn't necessarily have to be helpful for you as well, uh, but definitely a tip out there for anyone wanting to know. Uh, by the way, huge shout out to Ali Abdul on YouTube. He has suggested this way of studying for anatomy and I think it's really effective. So shout out to him for suggesting this. And so let me introduce you guys. Guys, this is Instant Anatomy, uh, the website I rave about all the time. And what I do is I take the images from this website, I'll copy them and I'll open up Anki and what I'll do is I'll change my card type to image occlusion enhance and I'll show you I'll show you guys how you can get this. So um, if you can just you know paste the image here. Um, so what you can do is actually don't paste the image like that. Just do this and okay I messed it up. <laughs> Let me just do that. So essentially what you do is you copy the image you open up Anki and then you just open up image occlusion, um, that little icon right there, the image icon. And I have two windows open now. Okay. And then what you do is you can just close up. Um, let's go 50%. Um, and I can just take the square, whatever shape I want. I could just cover this, cover this, cover this. However you want it, honestly, it's going to be a bit different. Okay, so these are the things I wanted to cover. Um, I can crop this part if I want to beforehand. Uh, and what I'll do is I'll just, I can either do hide one, guess one. So what I'll do is it'll hide one, show me the rest, and I'll just have to guess that. Or I can do hide all and guess one. So all of these will be covered and I'll get to guess each of them. So let's do hide all, guess one. And it'll be four cards because I put four little things to label here. Um, so then I just close, close, and I open it up and I have four new cards. So those are the new cards I have. And what I'll do is, okay, um, now thinking about this part, what is this part? Okay, mm, that seems like the anterior circumflex. Yeah, so anterior circumflex humeral. So yeah, so something like this, and then you just keep doing it and testing yourself until you get it, and it will be repeated many times. So yeah. And then you can see this bar right here. Uh, you can either do again, if you got it wrong, you could be like, okay, let me try this again. It'll give you in less than one minute. If you do good, um, in one day you'll be tested again. And if you do easy, you'll be tested again on this in four days. So yeah, that's just a bit about how that works. Now I'll tell you guys how to put in plugin or an add-on into your Anki software. So this is the image occlusion enhanced. I can put this in the description below. This is an add-on. Basically, you just need this code. You copy it and you open up Anki, you go under tools, add-ons, and then you just click get add-ons, put in the code, click OK, and then you have to restart Anki. So you have to X out everything and then restart it and then you should have this tool. However, I already have it, so it doesn't really matter. And so that's kind of how you add in plugins. Uh, there's a lot of plugins. You can get so many different types. So it's really up to you guys uh, what you like and how you want to go about it. There's tons of YouTube tutorials on it too. So yeah, that was a bit about image occlusion enhance and how I use instant anatomy to help me study uh, some of the nitty gritty stuff, you know, like the arteries, the veins. Sometimes that stuff is very forgettable, so this is a really nice way. Uh, the one other thing about Instant Anatomy is its diagrams. They're very like straightforward, simplified. There's nothing complicated about this. It's very systematic, and I absolutely love that. It's also completely free, which is even better. So you can even look at different joints. Let's say you want to look at the elbow joint. I mean, it basically covers everything. You can even look at head and neck. So it's really good. So I definitely recommend using this website to your advantage uh, because of how simplified the diagrams are and how conceptual they are as well. So yeah, that's, that's it for the Anki tutorial and anatomy lesson. See you guys next time and have a wonderful